All right, what's going on everybody? Welcome back to another video here on the channel. And today we're gonna to be talking about some new uh, news that's been kind of going on regarding the entire COVID-19 pandemic. I don't really feel like I need to do an introduction for this video. Everybody already knows what COVID-19 is. Uh, you may have had it. You know a family member maybe who's had it. Maybe you've unfortunately lost a loved one to the horrible virus and whatnot, man. But, uh, you know, it feels like in the last couple weeks with like the vaccinations and everything, right? The last couple months, the world's kind of been getting back to normal. Like I've been saying in a couple other videos, right? Like people are back in stadiums again, watching sporting events. Uh, they're doing music festivals and whatnot again too. And it just kind of feels like everything's kind of getting back to, you know, the pre-pandemic state. But unfortunately, uh, the Delta variant is now threatening to kind of change all that. So the, the Delta variant is basically just a mutation of COVID-19 that is apparently able to spread faster. It's more infectious. And even though a pretty good amount of the population now is vaccinated and we've seen cases completely drop through the floor, the last couple days or so, there's been a pretty recent surge uh, in new COVID-19 infections. And uh, they're kind of worried, I guess, that another wave of COVID-19 is about to end up happening. So another thing about this that is kind of, I guess, also under consideration is bringing back mask mandates. So obviously, you know, during the entire pandemic, pretty much everywhere had rules that like to go into restaurants or like go anywhere in public, pretty much you were going to have to wear a mask, right? Like they were having kids wearing masks in schools, you know, the employees of stores were wearing them. It was just, it was a widespread thing. You know, you had to wear a mask. Uh, of course, there was like this, uh, you know, mask versus anti-mask debate that kind of went back and forward. But it was something that was just part of our lives for months. And in the last few months, since the entire, you know, pandemic has started to kind of slow down due to the vaccinations, mask mandates ended up getting lifted. And uh, now with this recent surge, there is now discussion that they're going to bring back mask mandates and try to make everyone wear a mask, including people who were already vaccinated. So Anthony Fauci, the White House chief medical advisor said on Sunday, top US health officials were discussing whether to revise mask guidance for Americans vaccinated against COVID-19. Quote, this is under active consideration, Fauci told CNN's State of the Union, though he also emphasized that local governments can issue their own rules under current guidance from the Centers for Disease Control and Prevention. Los Angeles County and St. Louis, Missouri have reinstated indoor mask requirements and other cities are weighing whether to do the same. After a significant drop in COVID-19 cases because of the national vaccine campaign, infections are rising in all 50 states and Washington, D.C., the increases are highest in states with large groups of unvaccinated people. More than 610,000 have died from COVID-19 in the U.S. At a White House briefing on Thursday, the Surgeon General Vivek Murthy said 97% of hospital admissions and 99.5% of COVID deaths were occurring among unvaccinated people. More than 162.7 million Americans are vaccinated, or 49% of the population, according to the CDC. Fauci said local leaders, particularly in areas with low rates of vaccination, needed to lead outreach efforts to get people vaccinated. So if you didn't know, uh, vaccination rates have actually been kind of slowing down over the last few weeks. Less and less people have been kind of getting vaccinated. And I'm pretty sure the United States actually meet, uh, missed its COVID-19 vaccination rate goal that was set by the Biden administration. Even though there have been pretty good turnouts for the vaccine and, you know, half of the American population now is fully vaccinated, there's still this big issue with this Delta variant. And, uh, I mean, personally, right, like, I don't really want to see this all make a comeback. I mean, obviously, it never fully disappeared, but to see it make a comeback and be back on the level that it was before or even higher would be just horrible, dude. I feel like pretty much everybody, you know, we all kind of dealt with like this societal burnout with the pandemic because, you know, we're going through lockdowns and these mask mandates and everyone's like on edge for months on months on months throughout this entire thing. And I feel like now uh, people are kind of getting a sense of security back, right? With all of these vaccinations and everything, I feel like people are, you know, kind of feeling quote unquote invincible. Not literally. I mean, maybe some people literally, but, you know, as a total, not literally, but more or less metaphorically, right? Because they feel like, oh, you know, COVID's over with, right? Everyone's getting vaccinated. The the numbers are going down, right? Like we, we can do whatever we want again. And unfortunately that doesn't seem to be the case. So the CDC is under active consideration basically to revise mask guidance for people who are vaccinated against COVID-19. Now, obviously people who have not been vaccinated yet are recommended and realistically are supposed to be wearing masks in most places. 
But at this point, man, like no one really does, right? Like I, I went, I go to the store, you know, a couple times a week or whatever, go to different places and, you know, it'll say like right there on the front door, it'll say like, you know, vaccinated customers are not required to wear a mask. Unvaccinated customers are strongly encouraged to wear one because for the most part, mask mandates have pretty much ended. Some places are just not even taking it seriously. And in those places, like no one wears a mask. I mean, obviously not everyone in there is vaccinated and no one in there is wearing a mask and they're not checking vaccine cards or anything in any of the places that I'm going. Oddly enough, I have yet to see anyone show me a vaccine card. You know, I've never been asked for a vaccine card or anything, right? Quote, when you talk to people who run hospitals in New Orleans or other states, 90% of people in the hospital with the Delta variant have not been vaccinated, he said. That's another signal that the vaccine works. Fauci said the administration was reviewing whether some vaccinated people may require booster shots. Vulnerable people such as organ transplant and cancer patients were, quote, likely to be recommended for booster shots, he said. For Missouri, a local mayor told CBS has faced the nation some prominent local figures were still speaking out against the vaccine. Quote, we continue to have pushback against negative messaging, said Quentin Lucas, mayor of Kansas City. Lucas said the focus in Kansas City was on getting people vaccinated and that his city did not currently have plans to reintroduce mask requirements, though it was something that he had considered. Quote, I think every mayor in a major city in America is wondering if it's time to return to mandates, Lucas said. Jerome Adams, the U.S. Surgeon General under Donald Trump, told CBS the CDC should change guidance to vaccinate and mask in places with lower vaccination rates, an argument he also made in an editorial for the Washington Post. So who really knows, like, what's going to end up happening, right? I mean, at this point, these variant cases are still on the rise. Like, we're seeing COVID cases kind of surge again. And unfortunately, I do get the feeling that we are going to end up having to return to these mask mandates at some point, right? Because I'm not sure that the vaccination rate really is going to speed up to kind of keep up with all these new infections or whatever. And plus, there's a pretty significant portion of the population, especially here in the United States, that just blatantly is refusing to get the vaccine. And that is their own personal choice to make. You know, you're not being forced to take this vaccine. It is completely optional. And if you choose not to, then you choose not to. But a very significant portion of this country believes, you know conspiracy theories about vaccines or they don't think that they're effective or they're scared of them or they just don't care to there's a lot of different reasons that people aren't going out in mass to get this vaccine and i feel like the people who were already likely to get the vaccine have pretty much already gotten it right it's been out for months pretty much the entirety of 2021 the u.s has been vaccinating i really do feel like the people that were prone to get it are pretty much already getting it and that is concerning with the Delta variant rising and everything here. But I do see a complete major problem with, you know, bringing back these mask mandates, okay? We had these mask mandates for months, pretty much everywhere. The whole United States basically was under mask mandates. Even in places where, like, the top politicians openly spoke out and criticized and made fun of masks and the vaccine and the virus, there were still mask mandates for the most part. Even when those mask mandates were in place and like you were basically supposed to be forced to wear one to go in public, people still weren't doing it. When the pandemic was at its most crucial moment, right, where like the most infections were happening per day of the entire pandemic, people still weren't wearing masks, okay? People didn't care. They, they weren't going to get the vaccine. They weren't going to wear a mask. They didn't believe, you know, that the virus was real or as bad as people said it was. And if you couldn't change their mind when it was 10 times worse than it is right now, you're not going to change their mind now. They didn't care the first time around. They're not going to care now, right? Like, they didn't care from the jump. They weren't listening to the CDC from the jump. You think all of a sudden now that you, you bring these mask guidances back that these people are going to wear them? It just isn't happening, man. Like, it's just not going to go down. And not only that, you already had the crowd of people who don't believe in the masks and didn't want them in the first place. But there's also, I think, another crowd of people that you have to worry about this time that you didn't then. And that's people who are just straight up vaccinated who aren't doing this because, let's keep it a buck fifty here. One of the major promises of getting the vaccine was that we were going to return to a world where we didn't need to wear a mask. For the vast majority of people, the reason they got the vaccine was to not catch the virus, and so they didn't have to wear a mask when they went inside of a goddamn Arby's. Like, nobody really enjoyed wearing masks, right? And so people avoid wearing them, whether they just outright blatantly say they're not doing it, or whether or not they got vaccinated. You're not going to get people wearing masks again. And even though half the people in this country have been vaccinated, you're still going to have a large chunk of them that are like, hey, you know what? I got vaccinated. I really don't give a fuck. 
Like, I did my part, why should I care if nobody else wants to do theirs? If these people, you know, want to risk their lives, let them risk it. You already see it on social media. I've already seen this reaction building up to this announcement, building up to this news in particular. It's just not going to work, man. But anyway, with that being said, thank you guys for watching. If you did enjoy, make sure to leave a like. Subscribe if you're brand new around here on the channel. Follow me over on Twitter and Twitch at Subdoptimus. Make sure to check out Shop Opti down below. And until my next video, guys, this is Optimus Well. Just not really thinking this is going to work, if I'm being real, and signing out.